Another day, another fast food and celebrity partnership. KFC is partnering with rapper Jack Harlow for a new meal called, of course, the Jack Harlow meal. Yahoo Finance's Alexander Canal has the details on this one. And uh, Ali, I'm gonna try to do, I'm gonna try to do the, the Jack Harlow when I ask you this question. Like, uh, there's nothing different. There's nothing different about this menu. It's just they took a combo menu, put it together, and slapped his name on it. Exactly, Saz. And this was something, this is a partnership that was first struck in December. So this is a continuation of that partnership. Now, Jack Harlow is a Kentucky native. He's from Louisville. He loves KFC. So he basically handpicked a lot of these menu items, as you mentioned. We got a spicy chicken sandwich. We got mac and cheese, secret recipe fries, a side of ranch, very important, and a lemonade. So he really wanted to combo some of the newer items that KFC has introduced over the past few years, like the spicy chicken sandwich, along with those classics like the mac and cheese. But this comes as a lot of these fast food brands are leaning into celebrity partnerships. Of course, we know McDonald's. They're known for their famous orders campaign. They've partnered with celebrities like BTS, Travis Scott, Saweetie. We have Burger King with their own iteration called the Keep It Real Meals. They're targeting celebs with stage names like Nelly, Lil Huddy, who's a TikTok star. And then, of course, we got Make the Stallion, Popeyes, Lil Nas X, Taco Bell, Ooh. and the list goes on and on. So this Lil is really- Lil Lil Hot, Lil, Lil Hottie? Lil, 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 Lil Hottie. Top of your Lil Hottie, Lil Hottie. Lil Hottie, he's a TikTok star. Oh, I'm so old. But, but <laughs> no, but that's, that's the whole point. They really want to attract these younger types of consumers, oh. and it's sort of a follow the leader approach. McDonald's did it first, it worked for them. They've cited in several earnings reports that their famous orders campaign led to an increase of growth, an increase in sales. So I don't think this is gonna slow down. Oh, Brian, you didn't know who Lil Hottie was. I didn't. Come on. They, Come on. they need a fabulous partnership from me and <laughs> yes, Sazi. That yes. was the playlist she this was morning before the He show. was dating Charlie Emilio. So, you know, there's like a whole TikTok universe. I don't think they're still together. I don't know. I'm not totally in the TikTok world, but well, those creation houses. That, yeah. That's, that's the collaboration. You know, it's like a, it's a Gen Z. They okay. just they love these things. I mean, I, and of course, there was the one we were talking about the other day with Taco Bell and uh, the new pizza that they were doing that mm -hmm. they were going to do a partnership with. Uh, who was it? Dua Lipa or not Dua Lipa? Uh, well, Doja they, Cat. Doja Cat but and Dolly Parton were going to do the right. musical. Right. And they had to pull that. They had to pull the Mexican pizzas because they were overselling them. So, you know, we're, we're seeing a lot of this happen these days. And of course, they have that continued partnership with Lil Nas X. He's the chief impact officer or something yeah, at Taco Bell. I need my own partner. I got to drop my line, my guy over at uh, you should. Papa Papa John's. The, amount, the, the, the amount big of times sauce. We you big talk sauce. about fast food Yeah, chains. I want the big sauce promo deal from uh, Rob Lynch over at Papa John's. He's a CEO. Give You're me an a, influencer yeah, in the give finance me a 30, world. Give me a 30-inch, one-slice piece of cheese pizza one with, a lar slice. with a large bottle of water so I can take pictures of Instagram and just blow up over it. There you go. That's the sauce meal. The big sauce. The big piece, one-slice pizza. Big sauce.